Do you like green eggs and ham? We're going to find out how to make green eggs and ham. What do we got going on here besides the ham that's starting to smell really good? good. Alright, so we're putting some eggs in the food processor. We got two adults and a child to feed, so we're, what, going to put in six eggs? Six eggs, okay. Bag of spinach, then. We're gonna put what a handful or so of. Yeah, it's not a handful or so of spinach in here. By the way, I don't always use bag of spinach, but it's July about to be in a couple days here. Oh, those are done. Some of them were slightly overdone, but they'll still be out of it. Okie dokie. So the ham is pretty much done. All right, I'm going to grab a plate. You know those little clips that come on a balloon in the floral department? Save yep. them. You do this with them? Yeah, they're perfect or, you for know, the bags. bags of chips or whatever. All right, so then um, ham comes off onto a plate. Of course, the little boy wants to... Imitate words that he hears. Now for the green eggs. We've got six eggs and a generous, but not over generous amount of Hang on, this spinach. Seems bad. So I'll put the heat back on. About eh, level three out of ten. And, uh, you mind pouring that in? Not at all. Looks like it didn't entirely mix. Yeah, it's fine. Well, I want to get that leaf in there. Let's see if I can do it this way. We'll just let this cook up and see how that goes. It's been, uh, let's see, a couple of minutes. Let's get a sense of how this is coming together. Looks like we can... We don't want it sticking, so I'm going to try to slide these bits around. Very nice. So now at this point, it's just like making any random other omelet. For reference, this is a cast iron skillet. I picked it up at a sporting goods store of all places. Or did we? Yeah, Sporting Goods Store, Academy, Lodge brand made in the USA. One of the things about cooking egg dishes is that you want to take them off the pan just a hair before they're completely done, otherwise they'll get overdone on the way to the table. Anyway, that's green eggs and ham. How now it's time... Wait, tell us how long it took. Oh yeah, it took a grand total of about four minutes from putting it in the pan to having it be done. And Plus maybe three or four minutes of prep time of, you know, whirring up some eggs with some green stuff. And yeah, prep was real easy. Yeah. Now let's see how it works on the little boy. Hey Arthur, do you like green eggs and ham? Let's find out. Well, he's eating the ham... That's too big a bite to stuff in my mouth with all this other stuff that's still stuffed into my mouth. <laughs> really? It's too big? I've seen him eat bigger bites than that. 
Let's see about now. Oh, yeah. I think it's ham is preferred and green eggs are a nice alternative or maybe a, a follow-up. <laughs> maybe the ham is the appetizer. That yummy ham? Is that yummy ham? You like your ham, don't you? Do you like your green eggs with your ham? Do you like green eggs and ham? <laughs> Arthur, it's good. It's too big a piece here. Okay. Yeah, that's what it was. Yes, yes, I do like green eggs and ham. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Sam. We have this in the food processor. What's the matter? Water in the cup of the food processor. Uh. <laughs> Retake. Okay, okay, that's enough fingers. <laughs>